Come on, already. One, two, ready, go. Okay, I really need a theme song, bro. But that's just by the way. Careful. Yes, now. Ta-da! Guys. Nah, ta-da. Welcome to another cheerful <laughs> podcast episode. I'm excited this evening. My dear, you feel it? I'm alive, man. I'm alive. <laughs> I feel it. As you can see. Hey, Jesus. Careful, bro. I'm careful, okay. Careful, bro. Careful, bro. How far now, YG? Guys, this is YG's fresh air quotes. Guys, that's, that's the issue. most important thing on this episode. That is not the issue. Most Shell. important thing. Shell, we are here to talk about Bonner Boy, please. Okay. And the people are waiting. I know all. I know people all. are waiting. Let's, let's get into it. People are waiting. Straight up. So, so, guys. Let's ask you a very important question, yeah. YG. How did you feel about the album? Um, twice a store, twice a store. First, um, the rollout um, is grand. That's the first thing at, I'm going to say. At this point, at yeah, this point, we should rollout, expect nothing. Yeah, else. the rollout is grand. Um, it's there's a lot of um, dramatic effects to it. That was, that's the word I'm going to use. Dramatic effect to it. So like, um, ultimately, it made um, obviously everyone's expectations of Bonner Boy, um, including myself, really high for um, twice a store, and. Um, I mean, I've I've gotten I've taken it in enough, mm-hmm. and um, I don't want to drop this hot take just yet. I'll say it drop much it, later. <laughs> drop it. Let's start. Let's start with so, this. So okay, I can see like the intentionality in trying to like make sure it is Grammy quality, and I think it is Grammy quality. Mm-hmm. But I still just fear that it might not still win a Grammy. A Grammy. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I still that. just fear that it might not win a Grammy. But um, let's actually go into the music. Um, what what are your favorite like your your jams and why? A jam is intro, outro. Okay, so I'm just going to explain. So there's what I think I enjoy the most about mm-hmm. albums is like progressions and like mm-hmm. how the person thought through it and making like crafting their album, like not just taking chances and putting yeah. different songs in different places. Six that box for me. Yeah, though. so that 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 is like I like how it progresses. Mm-hmm. I really like I really like Intro, outro, mm-hmm. they, they slapped for me. That, mm-hmm, that's like mm-hmm, mm-hmm. a major thing I check for when I listen to albums. To albums yeah. um, then he has this thing that he has been doing since outside. Like mm-hmm. this whole progression mm-hmm. thing. Mm-hmm. He has really, really followed through. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Then like this reminds me a lot of African Giants. So mm. uh, like when he decides to be like there's a part in the album where he will decide to be political, which is the song with Coldplay for this mm-hmm, for this particular mm-hmm, album, which mm-hmm. is a song that I also really yeah, like. That was Monsters uh, We Made. Yeah, Monsters We Made. Then I like that song that I'm going to dance to when um, my evil babes are wrecking Waiting my heart. Up. No, no. Um, Oyeka. Oyeka. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I really like Oyeka. Ah, jam. Nice um, one there. Nice one, nice what one, nice what one. I like a lot. I like 23 a lot as yeah, well. Yeah, 23, like 23, 23 is, a lot as well. 23 is vintage Bonner sound. Yeah. Like so I guess, vintage Bonner sound. Yeah, so I guess those are like some major tracks for me. What oh, are yeah. some of your favorites? Um, Definitely um, Onyeka. Um, definitely Monsters You Made. I love I love Monsters You Made a lot. Like a whole lot. And um, I forgot one jam. Which one? Naughty by Nature. Um, no, Naughty by Nature. I really like Naughty by Nature. I mean, it's a jam, oh. It's a jam, oh. But, like, I feel like it was was a bit too long. That's why I feel. Same. Fair yeah. Place to that. I feel like it was a bit too long. Um, there is also... I like waiting this up. I like okay. I like waiting this up. And, um, this guy's production tells is really, like, exciting. I had, like, four tracks on yeah, that. Yeah, like, four that tracks I produced. Like, produced. And then bank on bank bank on me. Outro. Yeah, the outro. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah, yeah intro, yeah. outro, <laughs> intro, <laughs> outro. The song yeah, that came after up. the yeah, outro. Yeah, yeah, and yeah, yeah, yeah. Alarm clock, alarm clock. Yeah. Right after the intro, like yeah. it was a very like it was very good progression. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Uh, I remember when we went to when we asked for some people's opinions and they said it was mid. Oh yeah, and I and I acted outside outside. I, I outside. didn't agree with that. Thank you. Yeah. I just listened to them. You, you know, I was very calm with, with Manny the other day. Of Shout out, so. Manny. You said um, <laughs> twice. I told is mid. If you're listening, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> fuck you. <laughs> I'm dying. Um, yeah. So outside, I like someone else that I talked about music but that this is the podcast mm-hmm. also engaged me in a conversation about twice at store, mm-hmm. and I feel like. 
a problem that a number of people could have is you we have this expectation of Bonner uh, yeah. and then like this kind of seems like like you're not surprised yeah, not by surprised it. By like it's it, not. Yeah. It doesn't catch you adrift or yeah. something. But like, I still feel like, man, when you when you intentionally listen to it, when you think about the artistry, like we've yeah. never gone into what the significance is, like mm-hmm. stuff on the album cover mm-hmm. and like, you know how how he thought through it. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. Yeah. So like, I think all of that is left out because you know, man, it's fucking Bonaboy yeah, and man. you just expect so, so much. much. Yeah, and yeah. I feel like um, for us as Nigerians that yeah. we've been listening to Bonaboy for I quite mean, a, for quite, quite, a quite some time now, yeah. like, I feel like we've probably gotten used to like, quality. And for him, like, he's just like, breaking into like, new places. So, of course, no. in as much as like, we might feel accustomed to the sound. Number one this, album in the world. Yeah, man. In as much as we as Nigerians can feel begin to feel accustomed to the sound there are still people that like don't worry it's still new to it's, them and his bang is busting their brain of course, of course. <laughs> he's busting their brain like who the fuck is this person so yeah man so um i so i'm just going to do this so african giant or twice of store I, I prefer not to speak <laughs> if, I, if i speak i mean i'm in big, Guys, trouble. I'm in big trouble african giant or twice a store so drop a comment. If you if you watch to this point, just drop a comment. African Giant or Twitter. So you can hit us up on social media with your comments. So <laughs> yeah, I'm dead. I'm so, dead. I'm dead. But dead. yeah, um, Twitter stall exciting album actually. Yeah, and let's see, man. I want it to win the Grammy, but I'm afraid it might not. So before I'm guys, we say I'm I'm a hater. Please, hater, oh, please, oh. hater, I love Bonner Boy. Hater, <laughs> you know, I you mean, know it's... this is an official Bonner Boy podcast. Yeah, actually, way. actually, so, why, why, why the well, official Bonner Boy podcast? If you know, just go in the gram. It's a premium, but it is what it is. It What's is next, my G? What it is. What's next, my G? So yeah, uh, I don't know if you came across. Um, Radical the Kids EP called Little Planet. Uh, yeah, I came across it, but I only listened to one song. There's a song with Amari on it. Yeah. Yeah. I, I like that song. I only listened to the song with Amari. And um, I, 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 I don't know. I think I'm in love with Amari itself. <laughs> Stop it. Stop I think it. I'm in love get, with get your own, like, see, we'll fight after. <laughs> anyway, uh, so apparently, uh, Radical Kid is mm-hmm. a producer. He's yeah. currently based in is Ghana. Ghanaian? No, he's not. But he's based in Ghana. He's based in Ghana. Uh, is he Nigerian? No, he's not. Okay. He's uh, i I think he's from Benin. I'm not sure, okay. but he used to. I think he's also American. Oh, I know. But now he's based in Ghana. Nice. So, uh, you know, when I when I listened to it and like I found I was going to talk about, it, I just did like nice, just nice, like nice. Nice. So, nice. so uh, obviously, he's a producer. Mm-hmm. Um, what else? Uh, he has a, a tape that preceded this. Sadly, I've not been able to tap into it as that much one. as I wanted. Yeah. What's the name to. of this one? The name of this one is the. This it's called Little Planet. Little Planet. Little Planet. By Radical the Kid. Yeah. Nice. So the part, the song that like I really really listened mm-hmm. to was the first one, mm. and that's like full on like like straight up production. Mm. I like how. I feel like I always say I, I like the instrument choices. No, we have to say that. That's, that's, I feel like I say that every time, man. No, 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 no. <laughs> my G, feel free. Because that's that's yeah. that's solidly what music is about. Like, true, true, so true. Let's talk about it. Um, yeah, I, li- I like the instrument choice. Um, I think I remember strings being on that. And like how... Yeah. I, I don't know, for some reason, I felt it was long, but like mm. after a couple yeah, of listens, it. like I really started to enjoy it. Mm. Then he progressed to this song that had Nonso Amadi. Yeah, I caught that feature yeah. too. Uh, then, How was Nonso on yeah, that? Nonso, Nonso was good on it. Nonso was good on it. So it has, like, it's kind of electronic. Mm. It has, I was about to ask what is his, like, yeah, it's, it's kind sound. Of, yeah, it's kind of electronic, mm. but it isn't, like, it sound, It also sounds fresh. It sounds, it sounds like, Sounds different. Different. But, mad. you know, I would like to fully tap into the frequency. But, like, mm-hmm. I felt like, you know, it was something to bring up for, like, hopefully if someone that's looking for something new, mm-hmm, this would mm-hmm. be something they would enjoy. So, yeah, that's man. Radical The Kids, Little Planet EP. Little Planet. I'll check it out. And, guys, you should check it out. Um, I mean, we're just trying to push good music as much as possible. So Standard. Check it out, my Gs. What's next, my brother? So, I mean, I, I feel like, I feel like, 
were becoming an adequate <laughs> there's not an adequate no we talk. said it in the last episode yeah. no yeah yeah so, yeah so i i mean it's dj tunes's Kwame. yeah man how do you, you feel about it um so i'm um, shout out what i'm about to say shout out to larry because i saw him tweet it okay and he was like they should have just <laughs> left left sorry as i said leave <laughs> keep going, keep going. left left the old jam for whiskey yes, i mean of not course, <laughs> of course of course no argument no argument there so i mean every like the other guys did like they did well they did they tried i feel, I, I feel like they tried but i feel like you could tell that where everybody one. was yeah you could tell where yeah, everybody like yeah yeah like you could clearly tell that oh oh well, this person is Mm-hmm. getting like you know the person's getting into this thing this okay thing. this person is knowing their sound, knowing their sound and yeah, then somebody yeah. just, just said, knows that this is i'm coming to bully all of you <laughs> what, what do you think we're doing here this is my like this is as in this I'm, my domain this is my domain thank you that's what i'm looking for so that that's whiskey's domain and i think yeah. between like himself and dj tunes i'm sure they've made like so much music of course, so of course. like I'm sure, like, it was a dream for Whiskey Dwayne, maybe. I don't know. The guy produces those beats, right? DJ DJ t- I want to wait. See, if DJs don't produce, well, I, some I, know, of them I know some produce, of them don't, yeah, and I know some produce, of them do. Some of them produce. I don't well, know who, are, I don't, who sure. are you shading, YG? Who are you shading? <laughs> Let's let's no, let's, I'm not let's anybody. <laughs> DJ Tunes, just in case you are watching, just let us know if you if you produce. I don't want to check the internet for that. Say let us know. <laughs> let us Do know. you know him? <laughs> Who are you? So, no, 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 no. Who are you? No, Who are you? No, Do you have DJ Tunes? Do you know why you do lies? No, Maybe yourself. I know. Actually, I know why you're on the streets. <laughs> <laughs> I try no idea on this so, streets. but yeah, back to Pami. Like they should have just left the jam for whiskey. But let's try to enter. Okay, I didn't gold. I mean, his I part felt gold really part short. Was nice. Yeah, it was, it was short nice. a bit. But I mean, it did is gave me calm vibes. Mm, or Malay too was um like, was good, was good, it was, it was good. good but like, I just knew that was whiskey still. <laughs> yeah, it was whiskey's jam. But like <laughs> it jam. Um, but it's less... good. It's good exposure for Mali. I'm excited for him. By the no, way, no. like getting on the record with whiskey. Of course, like, more people are going to I mean, catch okay. up to him. I mm. like his. I was going to say he's one of his kids' kids, <laughs> but yeah, man, you guys should check out. <laughs> you guys should check out <laughs> for me, me man. by DJ, DJ Tunes. Are they cool? Gold whiskey and Omale. Spectacular. What's next, my so, G? So, Omo, I think we should talk about. I, I, let me ask. Have you listened to the Ignis Brothers tape? No, I haven't. But I saw a lot of people tweet great things about it. So I know you have listened. Yeah, I've listened. Yeah. I'm going so, to listen to it. Yeah, man. Yeah, yeah, hooligan. <laughs> That's all I have to say to you. I'll give you assignments. You can't do it. Fuck. Sorry, yeah, no. I'm, I'm tired of you. I'm yeah. about to crack a school joke, which I'll, I'm glad I did not crack it. <laughs> I, I, I prefer not to speak. I prefer not to speak. I prefer not to that. So, so I've listened to it, but so I'm at this point where I'm really. Like I have lucidity, like maybe only in the morning right now. Because, like I'm very flustered, <laughs> yeah, man. and for some reason I've not been able to listen to it in the morning. Mm. So like a lot of the times I've listened to it is mostly sonically, mm. but and like they have seen a lot of stuff that I have to pay attention mm-hmm, to mm-hmm. to break down properly. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. But outside outside of that. Mm. I can tell that it's very folk and like traditional, like mm. songs where. You can't well, That's their pin now. Yeah, that's actually that's their Yeah man, that's their that's domain. Their, yeah, that's their domain. <laughs> uh, so yeah, it's really folk, very traditional. A number of songs are kind of laid back. Other ones are like pretty progressive. Like yeah, I, I really like the songs that are progressive. Mm-hmm. There's this verse with flow mm-hmm. that I really, really like. Mm-hmm. Um then yeah, sand and shells and for you. I really like those two songs. songs. Um, check that out. Yeah, um, check that out. Yeah, and I liked I liked how because it's Edwin and I don't know I cannot remember the I other think, person's um, name. It's a lady and a guy. A yeah, lady yeah. and Edwin. Yeah. Um, so I like how. Shout out Edwin, by the way. Wow. Shout out Edwin. Shout, Shout out, out the lady that I'm going to link. <laughs> no, I wonder mean, what I'm saying. I feel, I, mean, I feel terrible. I mean, I mean, shout out the lady, but I, I know doing personally. That's why I have to shout. I know him personally too. Yeah. Like, stop, stop, like, no, I know no, famous I'm, people I'm, too. I mean, yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, don't kill me. <laughs> yeah, man. Don't kill me. Yeah. So, so but yeah, man. Back to the tape. What's yeah, the name of the tape? Let's let's. Name let's, of the tape is "The Cost of Our Lives." The cost of our lives by the Ignis Brothers. Yeah. Yeah. So um, I like I like this. 
I'm about to make a juxtaposition, but like, you know when you have like group stuff, can you remember, I always reference to me and wow. you know, That's good tip now. Yeah, good, that's um, a good collab that's tip. Good so like, collab tip, oh, like I could see that back and that forth back and thing forth that they were doing. Mad. So there's something like that you Yeah, there's something like that in a number of mad. songs. I'm yeah, so like I really, I really enjoyed, I really enjoyed like, it. Like, I mean, I feel like we can go the next 10 years and we'll never get a, like, if Simi and Fowles don't try to do something like that, we might never get a chemistry that's like, ah. I'm serious, in Nigeria, in Nigeria. I'm, hope, I'm hopeful <laughs> that, I'm hopeful that a couple other people can do it. Also, I think this thing is on that level. Oh, which one? Yellow. That's Remy Baggins and no, Eric. No, no. I, I was looking at it from the male female, male, female perspective. Fair place, ah, right. no, yellow, please. <laughs> yellow is, I feel like yellow is on that. Yellow like is on that tier. Good tip. Yes, I, I agree think it's on that tier with tips. But I was looking at it from the male and female, male, female perspective. Angle. Yeah. So, now that I think about it, I don't think there are a lot of male, male female. female. Yeah, that's that's why I was bold to say that now. Between twenty six, it came out twenty sixteen. So we're in twenty twenty now. I don't think there's okay. Why see and why see and Bella? I mean, they but tried. They tried, but... There were jams of that, but yeah, it's, not, it's, not, it's not on that level. Chemistry. I don't think it's that level. <laughs> it's not chemistry. I thought it was good. Yeah, I thought it was good, but yeah, I don't think it's on yeah, that level. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So, so, yeah. Um, Ignis Brothers. Ignis Brothers. The, the cost of the our cost lives. The cost of our lives. Guys, check it out. Um, Shane was plugging us, and I'm going to listen to that, too. I'm all true. I've been plugging. <laughs> all true. <laughs> You'll be the plug now. You shock you. Major key alert. <laughs> <laughs> Major key alert. Yeah, no kill me, my G. <laughs> so, do you want to talk about the next thing, or you know, you still leave the no, floor? No, no, I leave the floor to you. The guys are feeling you now. You and can't I, see they are telling you yeah, that sure, you're feeling. Yeah, sure, I'm yeah, sure. sure. Right on, my brother. Yeah. Make no shock you. Right, right on, on Pastor. <laughs> right on. No worries. You're not the one I want to hear that from. But, <laughs> <laughs> but let's go. I was waiting break. for you to crack a joke. Like I was waiting. I was waiting for you to crack a joke. <laughs> oh my God. Yeah. So, Go on, my G. Have you listened to Major Vibes by Major Banks and <laughs> Terraqua? So No, I haven't. YG is just <laughs> I need I need a different host. Yes, guys. YG, <laughs> come, 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 come off from my side with this guy. <laughs> guys. So uh, um I'm gonna tell a very interesting story. So one of the let me change it from interesting to short. In one of the most exciting times of YJ and I's lives, yeah, man. Uh, we got on Terry Apala. It was yeah, this man. day we went to play basketball. Yeah, man. Coincidentally, with money. <laughs> <laughs> and they're like, on our way back, we went to chill at the bar. Mm-hmm. And they're like, we had we had separately listened to Terry Apala. <laughs> but then on that day, I think we put money on to him. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. And they're like, he just scattered his head. Bro. It's Terra got Palau is a gem. Don't worry. Yeah. And I'm even angry that I've not listened to it because... <laughs> I'm actually angry with get, myself. Get, get, get from people here. people have been tweeting, like, I've caught a few, not people, Shia, but I've caught, yeah, like, a few I, I, tweets. I don't think a lot of people but, yeah, listen as much, to be Bonaboy, honest. Bonaboy, I'm like, Bonaboy And Bonaboy dropping, has taken yeah, the whole... Bonaboy dropping really affected so, a lot of things. So, yeah... That story linking back to this, it was actually money that sent this to the group. The group man. <laughs> yeah. So when he sent, I was like, "Oh yeah, man, I should get on it." Um, how do, how do, how do I put in this tape? Okay, I feel okay, like he's still on that trap vibe. That's the first. Yeah, he still ask. he okay. had he has this song that like the song that struck me the most was he was trying to do drill. Mm, yeah. Right. So um, I like I like the tape. Mm-hmm. I like the idea behind it, but like I feel like. I feel like we're still yet to see the the full thing. Yeah, I still feel like it's not fully still, formed. Yeah, it's still not fully formed. Mm. Um, I like. Let me just leave it that it's, it's not yet fully formed. Fully formed yeah. I, I I want to hope that you know there's still a lot more consistency. Mm-hmm, he still puts mm-hmm. out some music, mm-hmm. and then I believe if that happens, it mm-hmm. will catch. To catch up. But yeah, I don't think it's there yet. That's but I yet. believe it can get mm-hmm, there. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, mm-hmm. That's really what I feel about yeah, it. Yeah, and I feel like that has been like a major um, P for Terry Akbala. Like I mean, since Champion Showers, I think Champion Showers is still his best song. Mm-hmm. Um, it, it released like. Um, Two singles, like I'm, I'm consciously aware of between 2016 Champagne Showers and maybe two others. The other two felt like misses, honestly. I can't remember their titles now, but I mean, I remember there was a video for one. Yeah, there was a video for one, and yeah, probably shot the video for Champagne Showers too, right? I actually don't know. Yeah, I think he did. So, and he has always been like since Champagne Showers. I feel like he has always been just almost there, almost there, almost there, almost. I there. was good on that MIA feature. 
um, on rendezvous. On, on rendezvous. I want rendezvous. to say on code. On code is so good. Rendezvous. No, no, no. It was on rendezvous. So, yeah, yeah, it was on. Yeah, yeah. I remember yeah. that. Yeah, I, I yeah. I was really good on that. I enjoyed that. Really yeah, yeah, really yeah, yeah, yeah. That. I enjoyed that. I enjoyed that a lot, actually. I remember that. So yeah. Um, what's the name of the tape again? The name of the tape is Major Vibes. Major EP. Vibes, Matt, by Major Bangs and Terra. And, and I, I think uh, from like my knowledge of Nigerian music, I enjoy when like Major Bangs production. Yeah, Major, yeah, Bangs. Major Bangs. That I know that's. Should I talk about him a little bit? Yeah, we can. So we the can. first Major Bangs thing I had was he was doing dubstep Matt. with uh, with Tycoon. I don't Matt. know if you remember Tycoon. Ah. Yeah, and then from there. I, I thought that was like a great partnership, but like dubstep kind of <laughs> fizzled out. And I feel like they could have still Jeez. continued. They, they mm-hmm. could have like tried to evolve it into like dance mm-hmm, mm-hmm. and not not depend on just the Nigerian market. But this thing I'm saying is hard man, to do. Mm-hmm. It's very hard to do. So yeah, but then not, like Major Bangs have, has been on notable tracks. Mm-hmm. Um, I'm trying to remember the Fino song. There was this Fino song yeah, that was really, really, really yeah, big. Fino, probably what Lamy did too. Yeah, so yeah, uh, yeah, that's Major Banks, and yeah. then like the production on this, like I could see, his... I could see, eh, I could see it was intentional, and he was very like Terry centric, mm. like he had Terry yeah, on his that, mind yeah, when he was, when making, was making the beats, the beats for this. Mad, so mad, mad. yeah, I think I think it was a good attempt. I want to hear. I don't think it's quite there yet, mm. but like I believe Terry can do it if he consistently puts out more stuff. Let's see, fingers crossed. Check out Terry Akbala, Major Banks, Major Vibes EP. Um, sure, yeah. I think this is going to cut soon. Jesus, I'm telling you. Who are you, guy? Or... No, I have to go. Why do you not care about me, people? <laughs> <laughs> hey, Jesus! What happened? Don't, don't, don't even say anything that'll break my heart. <laughs> don't say anything that'll break my heart. It ended at. It must have ended like four minutes ago. Yeah, so no, no, Allah, no, Allah, we go, we go join now, we go join now. No, but I'll, I'll get to like, do you get what I'm saying? I, I get what you're saying, guy. Yeah, I get what you're saying. Don't see, have faith in me, man. Believe based on believe. Ah, guy, yeah, you don't even believe yeah, in me at all. <laughs> no, Allah, I'm afraid, Joe. That why Jay is okay. afraid, man. Tell, tell this nigga to have faith. Yeah, I'm afraid, anyway. So, I think this is a good point to just go into the major talking point for the day. I don't yeah, know what you feel. Yeah, man. Share, share with us with um, a, an exciting um, talking point, which when he said it, it surprised me, but at the same time, it blew my mind. No, it didn't surprise me, but at the same time, it blew my mind. Yeah, that's what I wanted to say. Fair. So, Sean, I think you should intro guys into the punchline okay. you dropped yesterday on my head. <laughs> so, do you guys, do you guys know that Reminis, aka Alaga Ebile, does not have essential on <laughs> Apple Music? I like the way he said Alaga Ebile. It's true Makes now. Like one <laughs> it, what he is is <laughs> now? Why does he not have essentials on Apple Music? <laughs> and she said something about, like, his on, unarguably, what did you say? I said he's unarguably yeah, the top, top 10, 10 rapper in Nigeria. Nigeria and yeah. he, Arguably, maybe five. Yeah, yeah, and I, I definitely no. Arguably five. Arguably five. Arguably, arguably ten. ten. Yeah, definitely, <laughs> definitely. And yes, like it's actually first of all, Apple, Apple guys, fuck you guys. <laughs> I'm don't fuck it. Fuck <laughs> you Why do you say rubbish? I beg you, people. Guys. No, I'll come and do it for you. I'll come and add it. I don't know what you guys are talking guys. about. <laughs> come on for my side. I beg. Don't guys for don't guys for my market. Fuck, I'm dead. <laughs> Oh, well, sorry, you. No, no gas for my markets. You. But yeah, so, like, I mean, you can pl- we can plug you guys with essential. So, no, actually, that's that's the playlist. Yeah, that's the playlist for, for the today, episode. Obviously. To be honest, so like Rami is essential. There's El Aj, that one that I dropped in 2016. Yeah. There is even I forgot the first. I want the Billes, the major one, yeah, the one, quintessential one, man. So Apple yeah. Music guys should fix up. Like we are, me, I'm making. We are going to. We are going to playlist. We are making playlist. So essential reminisce. Funny story. Yeah. How I got the album was I was playing FIFA with James. <laughs> Shout out James, by the way. Shout out my Shout nigga out James. James. Shout out James. And then like we're just jamming um vibes and inshallah. Man. And then we just started like going back and like trading stories. And while while I was listening to it, 
I understood the album. Yeah, man. When I listened like, this morning, I understood it too. Yeah, the first couple of, and it was is act, it was actually in plain sight. So I don't yeah, know how I did not get no, it from the I jump. Mean, attention, man. Yeah, yeah true, shout, true, true, true. Was in plain sight. It was literally vibe mm-hmm. and shout. That's really <laughs> what the album is. Yes. That's actually you what said it straight is. Up, like, like, said it straight yeah. up, and no, I don't no, know why. Me, yeah. Yes, <laughs> and I don't know why it was still for me. No, like yeah, it's not clear yet. Yeah, yeah, man. Literally, I I assume like he just got into the studio with the diff like at different points with the different producers mm-hmm, mm-hmm. so that um, all these songs went yes, let me put them all these songs on the vibes and inshallah literally yeah. man you know, in as much as I, I still think like I still think like you see how that much, thing is not a cultural thing yes now yes and it, it start like he references where, he's, where it starts from yeah. on the last song yeah and um, um, over 2.5 2. which 5. is um, which he said something about Liverpool just <laughs> Liverpool the football team well, they literally yeah, just cross yeah, the ball and hope for the best, the best when they have like when they are <laughs> in like tight spots. <laughs> so uh yeah and then James just realized that like after like we finished the tape we're just going to play like the next best thing and the next mm-hmm. best thing was going to be Reminisce Essentials like yeah, just man, because because yeah, it goes with it. I will not find it. I will not find it. <laughs> I was like what the fuck is this? <laughs> And then, like, James James even tried to even curate, like, shop, from shop. his top yeah. songs and all of that. And, like, I just started hearing songs. And, like, no, I, jams, just, man. I just started realizing that, yeah, man, jams, man, don't, jams. like, if don't you're not ready to come correct, yeah, man. do not feature Reminis. Yeah, man, yeah, Don't man, feature yeah, him. Yeah, eat man. you up on your track. Yeah, man. The guy's also, solid. And he has jams. He Those has jams, jams he makes with SARS. That's what that was the next thing I was going to say. Oh, my fucking days. How, Reminis how, and you, SARS. how you know this, bro? No, 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 no. Great minds, my G. Uh-uh. Great minds. See those jams, reminisce and sars like they make like kakobi chicken and there's one more that really stuck with me. At that there was time. one that has whiskey. There's one that from has Malaga whiskey Ibile. from Malaga Ibile. There's one and one. They're they're like, no, no, no. Four, there are plenty. Five, no, no. The reason, the reason why I'm mentioning those is because I feel like those were like the smash, like these two in particular I have in mind. Like those jams are. Like I feel like they are Ni- Nigeria essentials. Yes, like no. <laughs> if you want to has, go into yeah, Nigeria, has features with every. He has feature. Yeah, that's Elenio. 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 Yeah, Elenio. Yes, yeah. that's other yeah. ones yeah, I can't Elenio remember. Fuck yeah, he made Daddy Me. <laughs> Daddy Me. With David O. David he has o. a song with Bona that didn't really blow up, but like blow, it was yeah. nice. Yeah, man. Ah, everything is nice. <laughs> yeah, yeah. Hey, the jam with David O. Yeah. <laughs> like so, I don't understand. No, why, like, why? 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 Why, why, all why, this? why don't you have? Remember just Apple Music? I feel like. Like other wow. than other than like I don't I don't know that people actually recognize him the mm. way he should be. Yeah, except when he now comes out with like a jam with yeah. the door whiskey and then people are like reminisce. Ah, oh, mad, mad. Yeah, so like, yeah, man. Yeah, man. So uh, going back to the album, like I really like how he started. It's, no, yeah, man. Yeah, uh, is, I think it was his daughter or his son. Yeah, yeah. At least this morning. <laughs> this morning. Yeah, is that is that like classic album? voice yeah, note yeah, stuff man, like every yeah, not, let me not say everybody but like a lot of people do it but like yeah, yeah. man i still enjoyed it no, when i heard it with this one it's life now like you have to yeah, enjoy it they are basically giving you i it's don't life. it's life that's it's just life. what that's it what is, it is. Just like, what i it love is. how you put so, it it's life man as in that's just what it is so, yeah man vibes and inshallah uh, yeah. i mean when when i listened when the festival came out i think obviously i was distracted yeah so definitely so but when i revisited re- re- revisited this morning um, I caught yeah. I caught what the yeah. you caught. Like, exactly. I could see what the guy was trying to do. Exactly. So, like it was clear. And yes, Ogaranya is a jam. That one no, no, for no, no. sure. Undoubtedly <laughs> the best song of the, of the tape. Ogaranya is a fucking jam. So, I, I, don't, I, I didn't think we needed to argue yeah, that. Like, what, that's what why I did not ask. <laughs> but what did you think when you like put it? No, no, okay, not necessarily put it, but what did you think about the one with Tiwa Savage? Did you yeah, I really like that's right, my next right, favorite one. Right. The one I didn't like as much until I understood the album was over 2.5. 2. Yeah, you mentioned that yeah. when we talked about it. <sighs> kind of uh, shaky as it's, it's kind yeah. of, but like, but it is, when you think about it wholesomely, it, was, yeah, yeah. it is an important, role, yeah, it is an important in song in so, the yeah, grand scheme of things. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. So, yeah. Uh, I want to actually hear more reminisce music at this point. Go and listen to my reminisce no. Essentials playlist. Oh, yes, I mean, but new, I mean new. In mm. fact, Actually, Man, yeah, you don't I'm know how many. Yeah, you know this is reminiscing <laughs> off. I and that's what I'm trying to say. Like even I me, I'm not listening to him enough. And Guys, like, I I'm promise just you, you haven't listened to reminisce enough. Don't argue with us. You haven't listened to reminisce like, enough. I'm just realizing it. I've so, not really listened mm-hmm, to him like as mm-hmm, much as mm-hmm. I should. 
uh, outside, I think maybe I, I spawned Baba Afusa once. Yeah, man. I listened to Alaga Ibile. I know, I raced Baba Afusa. It's Alaga Ibile that I listened to. <laughs> I raced Baba Afusa. And like, I didn't even listen to it as much as I should have. Should have, but yeah, man. I listened to Alaga yeah, Ibile. I think I'm going to raise Alaga Ibile. I'm going to play Alaga Ibile. Yeah, Baba Afusa, it is. Yeah, and, guy, Baba Afusa is mad. <laughs> yeah, fair, fair fucking place It's fucking that, enjoyable. Man. Like, it's so fucking enjoyable. God. Yeah. And it's just reminded me of a very okay. I, I don't yeah, say a good time of it wasn't really a good time because I was in Covenant and they were just fucking me in the ass. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> yeah, rubbish. Get shut up. <laughs> Why are you giving me that look now? <laughs> so they were just dealing with me, Sha. So, but I mean, those were kind of part of I the get, music man. that made me go through Covenant. Time, you get time, time of our lives, man. Yeah, man. Time of our so fucking it, lives. It, it helped me go through school well enough, and I'm glad. I feel like we've been shout good. out Reminis. Ah, Reminis, my guy. Shout out, and we are we are we are, we are giving yeah. them. We are going to show them what you the legend no, you are. Of course, of course. Playlist. definitely, definitely. So we are going to show them the legend oh. you are. I feel like this Tokyo poet was a little haphazard. <laughs> was it? I don't know, man. I don't know. Man, until, I until, it, until man. No, 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 no. I'm not saying Completely. I didn't enjoy it. Yeah, man. I'm not saying I don't know that I struck that we structured it very well. But for like I'm saying vibes that, and Isha, yeah, like. I'm, yeah, I'm saying that mm-hmm. to say that the album that he just released and. Mm-hmm. You should definitely check oh, yeah. out definitely. Vibes and Inshallah. Vibes and EP. Inshallah. And you can you can like jump on it as like for your cultural Yeah, definitely. I'm sure references and use, I'm sure usage. a lot of people have heard yeah, Ogaranya. Yeah. No, definitely. Yeah, like, so check out Ogaranya. Yeah, so yeah. I, I mean I was going to just end here, yeah, but like man. since we're already on Ogaranya, like there's a number of tapes coming out. Coming soon. out soon. I think um Fireboy is this week. Yeah, on Friday. Fireboy is this week. I think only gold who we spoke about earlier is this week. This week. Remy Baggins, who we also spoke about earlier, <laughs> should be sometime soon. Yeah. So man, there's there's music, man. There's music. We're, we're excited about it. I mean, very excited. I don't know. Out of all the ones I've spoken about, which one are you most excited about? Um, well, I'm stuck between Fireboy and Adikunle Gold, but I think I'm going to go with Fireboy. Mm. Yeah. Apollo. Yeah, because. Wait, actually, yeah, I was going to say Remy Baggins. <laughs> no, oh, I mean, when you when you spoke about Remy Baggins, yeah. I was going to tell guys how much you love. I don't think yeah, you've I ever. Like, I really, like, not, I really, really not like Remy Baggins. Love for Remy Baggins on the podcast. I really, so, like, I really, really like yeah, Remy Baggins. No, Remy Baggins is a legit guy. Yeah, guys, but I think like, fuck I with think him. There's this concept that we spoke about previously mm-hmm. about follow up albums. And I'm really intrigued to see that for Fireboy. So I think I might actually that is put... Why, that is exactly I think I, why. I think I might actually exactly, put Fireboy. This is, that, I feel, I, you know, as much as I'm a fan, the critic in me also wants to see what the I fuck think, is this guy going to I do next? I think he will deliver, honestly. Yeah. I think he fingers will. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Fingers crossed. Yeah, fingers crossed. So I'm, most, I'm excited for Fireboy the most. I'm obviously looking forward to Adi Kunle Gold's um, um, the tape. Then there's also Remy Baggins, like you Remy said. Remy Baggins. Yeah. And um, which, let me just bring this up on the podcast. The thing I asked about Fireboy and Odunsi yesterday. Yeah, of <laughs> course. This is a great point to end. I mean, we're on the same side. Yeah. But well, you know. I just want to know if, if, you watched, if, you're, if you're watching us right now, I need you to comment. Who do you think is the bigger artist? Fireboy. <laughs> or or don't see the engine. The engine. So I mean, obviously, we are not trying to pitch anybody. We're against. Them. We're not we're, we're both, tell, we tell them. We are both. We love both of them. Off of. Tell them what is um, off. Okay, of. it's off. Like their debut albums, Rare versus literally Rare versus. Is it? Um, is it LTG. off their albums? Yeah. It no, does. I thought it was off. A, off like reach and oh, all yeah, of that. No, no, no. Okay, yes. I'm going to the criteria like where we, we know, consider. Yeah, we consider when we're, when we're talking about it is. The de- their debut albums, mm-hmm. then reach and um, followership. Yeah, reach yeah. and followership. Also, it was an argument why J got since I don't know why why J is arguing. No, no, I didn't. Argue. I, I, I said I, I just engaged in discussion. I just I didn't argue. Um, I barely said shit in the conversation, but I just made them know that like Fabo is definitely bigger than Odusi at this yeah, point. Is is off. So I agree because of the success of the album. Mm-hmm. Fuck, yeah man, man that, yeah. that album was very very yeah. very big yeah. sucks it was it's crazy and, and there was one thing i shared with you and i was going to say it on podcast yesterday about someone someone said something that really struck with me was like people that know odunsi probably know fireboy yeah but people that know fireboy they might not, necessarily. Yes, they might not necessarily know who odunsi is and i legit 
if I know, they might know his, but they've not listened to his music yeah, before. It's, it's painful stuff. Cause so, Odus, I mean, Odus is a legit guy. Who, uh, yeah, man. When his church, oh, don't get it twisted. How about Odus? Can you hook me up with Dito Black? <laughs> Guys, shut up. <laughs> 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 uh, don't kill me, <laughs> man. Man, <laughs> but shout out for that verse. Oh. You don't know us, so, but we are telling you shout out for that verse. Standard, standard, standard. Shout out for that verse. And More. hopefully, we get music from like, cause I actually like when I. Like, I hear women that can rap, like they can spit. Do you get? I love yeah. it. Like there's there's another feel to it. End of things. <laughs> <laughs> guy, you get. So it's different from when a guy just yeah, 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 yeah. Well, when a woman is giving you better bars, flow, it's fuck, it's amazing, man. Yeah, man. So well yeah, let's talk about WAP. Speaking of rap music. WAP. Crap. Okay, yeah, that's that's a great point to end it on. Yeah, let's talk about WAP. Um, you know, <laughs> <laughs> you know what it is. Yeah, don't don't be sentimental. Eh? Don't let breast and yash. Don't let breast and yash. No, I don't, I, you. What do you think about WAP as a song? I've listened to new ones. Okay. <laughs> Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. I thought what, I thought it was good, and I kept saying I will watch the video, but I've not watched oh, it. Oh, you've not still okay, I so I can't even be saying breast now. Sorry, sorry, you've not watched. I still not watched the video, sorry, but like sorry. I mean, it's very like braggadocious, like yeah. based based off my one listener. Like, sadly, I don't think I'm the audience for it. Oh, definitely, you're not. I don't think I'm the audience but for I, it. So. At the same time, like you're a music consumer, so yeah, you have I an thought, opinion. Tell us your opinion, please. Of course, of course. <laughs> <laughs> of course, I didn't think it was a bad song. Okay, but I think it was a bad song, but like, I just didn't think it was specifically for me. For you, yeah. yeah. For me, like I've listened maybe twice, three times. I, I watched the video once, then I listened twice. Like, <laughs> then I listened twice, like without the video. And for me, it's just. I mean, I get, I get the message behind it. I get the whole point of yeah, it. Yeah, man. Why you oh. bring men are scum, guys? Yeah, no, let's, no. let's end this episode. No, but the, the, let's end wait, this. Guy, let me say what I want to say, please. The song is not all that. Like, for what it is, like there are, there are, there are greater songs like in the past from like people like Trina that are, like are more enjoyable than WAP. Exactly. That's what I'm saying. So yeah, guys. And <laughs> my son, see, the summary somewhat, is that WAP is overrated. <laughs> that's what I'm saying. But so, I mean, you have to have WAP shots. So if you're a lady, <laughs> that's what I'm going to tell you. I'm dying, yeah. I'm dead. I was going to say this is a no. good episode. Yeah, man. This was a good episode. Yeah, man. I mean, I'm this guy white. Well, not this guy, Shabba. I'm like, going to have a different host. Oh, because I know the next episode. I hope, I hope you guys, I hope you guys can't sue it. <laughs> guys, don't come no, me, please, please, please. Don't leave me. Don't, don't leave me. Leave me. <laughs> so yeah, man. I, I thought, I thought it was a good episode. Um, yeah, man. You know, follow us on you know our socials. Share. Really like to hear what you think about the episode. Yeah, man. And you know, till the next one. Yeah, man. Till next one. Subscribe before the next one, so that when yeah, the next man. one drops. You catch it. You'll be the first one to know. Ego B, Jesus. Careful, bro.